What's up YouTube? Jeff, your style OG. And on today's video, I'm going to share with you my everyday carry for 2022. If you're new to the channel, we release a new video every Monday, Thursday, and Saturday at 4 p.m. Eastern, discussing various men's lifestyle topics such as style, grooming, and dating. I invite you to subscribe, tap the notification bell, and join us. And to my returning friends like Anthony Banton, salute. Now, I recently realized I hadn't done an everyday carry video for about a year and a half, and I've definitely been getting some requests to do one. So ask and ye shall receive. On today's video, I'm going to share with you my EDC. I got some carryovers that I've been using for a while, but I also got several new additions that I'm excited to share with you. So without any further delay, let's hop right into it. Now, first up on my EDC for 2022 is a very exciting pickup I made around February of this year. And if you've been watching this channel for the last several months, I wear it almost every day. I tell you all the time, a stylist guide must wear a watch. And you definitely can't go wrong with this pickup, my Cartier Santos. Now, when you're talking about a watch that's a classic, it's sporty, but elegant, this one definitely fits the bill. This one is so much of a classic, it's one of the original men's wrist watch. It's considered the first pilot's watch. And what I love about the Cartier Santos, it's a great everyday watch. Elegant enough to dress up, but sporty enough for even casual situations. Now, I got the large Santos because I have bigger hands and a bigger wrist. It's an automatic movement, and I love the way the case is designed. It's squared off, but it rounds off and tapers onto your wrist, sitting very comfortably on your wrist with this thin case diameter. As I mentioned, since I picked up this watch in February, I rarely take it off. One of my favorite parts of my EDC, this Cartier Santos watch. Now, next up is something that I always encourage guys to use on this channel as well. I definitely believe in the power of men using a journal. I think a journal is very useful for men. You can jot down your dreams, your goals, your ideas. It helps you put some structure to your feelings. It helps you remember some important thoughts. Not only does it help you remember things, I think it's great to write down your accomplishments and your failures. And as part of my everyday carry, I've been using this Rico Bello Ruled hardcover lined lay flat journal. I love the acid free smooth paper, the vegan leather outside and the inner pocket. I'm someone you'll always see with a journal in my everyday carry. And I highly encourage every guy out there to use a journal as well. Now, of course, if you're using a journal, you're gonna need a pen. And although I do have some expensive pens in my collection, I've been using a very affordable pen lately. I'm absolutely loving this Uniball Jetstream retractable pen. I'm talking about affordable quality at a great price. I got three of these pens for around 10 bucks. And it definitely gets the job done. It has smooth, quick drying, fade resistant ink, a nice easy to grip and easy to hold handle with stainless steel accents. And you get the smooth, crisp lines of a Uniball pen but with the quick drying properties of a ballpoint pen. And although I really love my Mont Blanc pen, I find myself reaching for this Jetstream Uniball one more often. Now, of course, with all the things a modern guy carries in his EDC, you need a nice bag to transport it in. And I recommend one that's a great combination of style and function. Like the backpack I've been using a lot recently from today's video sponsor, Esri and their executive backpack. Now, without a doubt, this Esri backpack, I think has the best combination of style and function of any backpack I've ever used. The design is super minimalistic, but extremely functional. I love that this laptop backpack fits very well with the polished attire a lot of us stylist guys like to wear. It's minimalistic, but it's able to hold all your EDC or work items. And I love all the features that come with the Esri executive backpack. You got this keychain holder in the front, You've got side pockets to hold your phone and your wallet, and the two special slots inside to hold both your laptop and your tablet. Internal wiring for charging, and it's incredibly rain and spill resistant. Protected passport pocket and hidden side pockets to maintain a streamlined look. It has a super spacious interior with a top quality black lining, and I love these leather accents as well. And the main zipper can easily open to a full range of 180 degrees. And one of the things I really like about this backpack Look how it maintains its shape, even when it's empty. Hands down, in my opinion, you can't get a better combination in a backpack of sleek modern design and great functionality. Now, not only did Esri sponsor today's video, they've got a special offer for the Stylo.G family. When you hit that link in the description and enter discount code STYLO.G, you'll get 30% off your order. So if you're looking to pick up a backpack that's the perfect combination of sleek style and functionality, 
Make sure you hit that link in the description and pick up the Esri Executive. Now, speaking of things that are sleek and minimal, that definitely fits well in my personal style, and you'll see it throughout my EDC. Like my choice for a smartphone, I carry the iPhone 12 mini. I am someone who believes the smaller the phone, the better. I like it to easily fit in my hand and slide in my pocket. The iPhone 12 mini, being the world's thinnest and slimmest 5G phone, definitely fits the bill. I love that this phone is super powerful, it has a very vivid camera, and as I mentioned, the key here for me, I love a small phone. Now I know a lot of people love the bigger phones, you guys like carrying phones that are the size of an iPad, good for you, but not me. As companies move further and further away from smaller phones, I believe this iPhone 12 mini will turn into a classic. We're sticking with the theme of thin, slim, and minimal for the next item on my EDC for 2022. Now, every modern guy needs a slim wallet. That thick wallet of the past, that's your grandfather's wallet. And the wallet I've been using for the last year and a half or so, I absolutely love this Anson Calder card wallet. This Anson Calder wallet is perfect for me. Super thin, coming in around an eighth of an inch thick. It's made of luxurious French calfskin leather, and it has nice hand burnished edges. It's extremely thin profile makes it easy to slip in and out of my pocket. And I love this patent design element. These cutouts that make it easy for you to slide your cards in and out, fan them out, and grab the one you need. This has been my go-to wallet for the last year and a half or so, and I absolutely love it. Extremely functional, super thin, luxurious French calfskin leather. Can't go wrong with the Anson Calder card wallet. Now, as you often hear me say on this channel, every guy looks a little cooler with a pair of sunglasses. And my sunglasses of choice for the last several months, definitely these Ray-Ban cockpit aviator glasses. I've always been a fan of aviator glasses. They go pretty well with my big head. But what I love about these Ray-Ban cockpits, they're an update on a classic aviator. Although they have that great pilot aviator shape, they're a little smaller and more streamlined than your classic aviator usually is. I love the teardrop shaped lenses and these come with a nice thin lightweight frame. Now when it comes to classic sunglasses, Ray-Ban definitely is a go-to brand. And one of the most important things you want to pay attention to when picking a pair of glasses, make sure you grab a sunglass style that fits your face shape. And with me wearing my Cartier Santos watch almost every day, the metals in these glasses match well with my watch. A nice modern update on a classic aviator definitely can't go wrong with this Ray-Ban cockpit glass. Now, without a doubt, in your everyday carry, you're going to need tools that help you get jobs done. And the next item in my EDC definitely fits that bill. I always have the use for a knife, a pocket knife. I absolutely love this Steinbruch folding pocket knife. Now, with this channel, I get boxes delivered almost every day. I need a great sharp knife that easily opens them. I need a knife that's very ergonomic in all purpose. This one definitely fits the bill. It's the right side with the 3.4 inch blade. It's a high performance stainless steel reversible clip folding knife. It's razor sharp, super durable, and I love the stone wash treatment the blade finish has. It also has an anti-corrosion treatment and it comes with a glass breaker and a seatbelt cutter. One of the items I use in my EDC almost every day, love this Steinbruch folding pocket knife. Now next up is proof positive that I practice what I preach to you guys on this channel. And one of the things I often encourage you guys to do for great self-improvement is make sure you read as often as possible. And I don't care if it's fiction, non-fiction, or both, like I do. You will always find me with a book within reach. The current book I'm reading as an alternate between fiction and non-fiction is a great fiction book. Colson Whitehead's Harlem Shuffle. Colson Whitehead is one of my favorite authors. I read at least four or five of his books. And I absolutely love this one. I'm nearly done. This book is set in Harlem in the 1960s. It's a great crime thriller, but it's also a great case study and character study of the main character. What I really love about books, whether it's fiction or nonfiction, it allows you to put yourself in other people's places, learn from their mistakes, their life journeys, and apply their life lessons to yours. So I highly encourage you to read as much as possible. Keep a book in your everyday carry. Now, if you've been watching this channel for any amount of time, if you've watched any of my other EDC videos, you've definitely seen this item and it won't be a surprise. I always keep on deck my Listerine breath strips. Now, of course, you've got to keep that fresh breath. You have a lot of options, maybe some mints or some gum, but I prefer breath strips. To me, smacking on some gum is not stealth, it's not subtle. I like to keep my breath fresh, but I like to do it in non-obvious ways. And I've been using these Listerine breath strips for years. It's like having some on-the-go mouthwash. I love the portable design, and as I mentioned, it's much more discreet than chewing gum. Want to keep that fresh breath? 
keeping your EDC, these Listerine, breath strips. So as you can see from my everyday carry in 2022, I've got some great holdover items, but some very new exciting items as well. Do me a favor, let me know in the comment section which of my EDC items you really like. And even more importantly, share with the Style G family your everyday carry.